Guys, there's a bunch of seals just waddling. Whatever they're doing, slithering around all the way down there. We're gonna try to get as close as we can. I'll probably scare them ah! away. All the seals are pretty much just chilling around us on this rock down here. First time seeing something outside of SeaWorld. I don't know, I wish they'd come back. They're all just hanging out until we get out of here. <laughs> look at that seal over there. Oh, look at him popping his head out. Yeah, they keep poking their heads out and looking at us like, yeah, did they get the hell out of here yet or what? But no. So how was your seal experience? Guys, it was good. <laughs> the one thing that I was hoping didn't happen when we came all the way down to the water is to get my shoes and my socks soaked. So I was walking all the way to that big cliff where, and I left my camera behind and um, a huge wave came out of nowhere and then just, I was wet. But it's okay, we made it pretty far. We're trying to get all the way down to the end. We didn't want to resort to this, but we got a Nissan Versa Note. Very small car, but we got it for a good deal. We're gonna try to sneak into the San Diego Zoo and see how that goes. You ready, Christian? We're gonna have to hop one of these, uh, I guess like 15 foot walls. I really hope we can get into this place. That would be a sick story. Hopefully we don't get caught. We hopped over so many fences. We snuck into this place. Some old man followed us for an hour. We're literally five feet away from getting into the zoo. Just gotta hop one more fence. Are we good? We can get down. Just came over this fence. We're in. What? Guys, we made it into the San Diego Zoo. Christian, give me five. We didn't have to pay fifty dollars. Took us like an hour, but we finally got in. Before we almost got into the wrong place. We're gonna call Mike and try to meet up with him now. Yeah. This place is cool. That was the scariest thing I've done in quite a while. Not gonna lie, it's so it's documented on camera. It took me a very long time to find a way to muster the courage. Yeah, we didn't film the entire thing because we couldn't. There's only bits and pieces of what we actually did. I'll give you ten dollars if you connect the dots. What? Oh hey! <laughs> Pumba! Where's Timon? There's Timon. Timon. Did you have fun at the zoo? Yeah. So a bunch of weird stuff. Oh my god, what are those things? They're deadly. Alright guys, we're here at the Santa Monica Pier. And just like Coney Island. Yeah, but it's basically just a date spot. And I don't have a date. Well, here's my date. Me and Christian found this group of people just dancing because we heard music and we followed the music and then we saw salsa and merengue and bachata which are all Spanish dances. So after a little bit of time of us trying to convince ourselves to get out of our comfort zones we finally decided to just say whatever we're gonna do it and we just got in and started dancing. It was awesome. So I step back. Christian's getting dance lessons from the best dancer on the floor. And then we continue the dancing. One, two, three. It was really, really fun. And after about an hour or so of me and Christian just dancing with these random girls and strangers, which was awesome. Too bad we didn't get all of it on film because I was just having fun and I didn't want to film everything because I wanted to be in the moment. But Mike and Amanda met up with us and I told Mike what I learned that night from salsa because that was my first time dancing salsa ever and it was awesome. <laughs> I 
on our way to pick up Mike and his girlfriend in Huntington Beach. It's really nice out today. It's warm and hot and sunny. Guys, we are going to San Diego now with Mike. Dude, the seatbelt is so weird. And his girlfriend. I hate 2016 cars. It's like a backpack. <laughs> Made it to San Diego. It's about a two hour drive. Me and Christian are going to explore around the city. Christian, what do you think of San Diego? Is it too quiet for you? Way too quiet. It's boring so far. See if we can find something to do. So what are we going to do right now? Find Balboa Park. So we're here at Balboa Park. Don't know what this place is, but the architecture here is incredible. This place is beautiful. So far, so good. Thought San Diego was gonna suck, but I like it now. It's only this place though, Balboa Park. Good job, San Diego Balboa Park. It's a great place. This sign says, if you're going to explore San Diego, start 75 million years ago. That tells me that we are here at the wrong time. So we're just going to go home now. And we're just going to leave San Diego. Bye. Sounds good. Warm up. Now we're ready for photos.